Mike. So we've just got back from RuneFest 2016. Um, it's really, really cool getting to meet some devs and a lot of the players and really getting an understanding for what RuneScape and Jagex do in 2016. Yeah, um, and they gave us loads of loads of interviews. It was really, really good. And for a lot of those interviews, we're the only people with the camera there. So we've got tons of exclusive content coming out over the next week um, to stick around if you want. Uh, we did have one interview in particular that we wanted to just get up as soon as we could because um, it was Mark Ogilvy uh, talking about the future of the RuneScape expansions. So big update today, RuneScape expansion. So, Talk me a little bit through like the thought process behind that, obviously moving away from the more regular content to do bigger things and, and less frequently, but more yes. in it and kind of more solid packs. So our players um, tell us that the updates that we release are awesome, but they don't like it when we do it in parts. They want everything to come at the same time so they can really sink their teeth into it and you know just chill out in one area of the game for an extended period of time just absorbing everything that it's got to offer and actually it works quite well for us as well because it means we get to hide all sorts of content in there and really allow them to genuinely explore an adventure and that's really what the game's all about so and from a lore and story side point is that a lot better for you because you can you can really kind of instead of writing chapters of a book you're allowed to write an entire yes. story and yeah. then every single element exactly yeah. it's about meat yeah. there's a lot more meat in the content yeah. that we can give to them and that's a good thing yeah. so yeah it's just more more like more at the same time yeah. more for them to enjoy yeah. and you know we'll still have the ninja updates coming along still be the quality of life stuff that we do all of the time but it just like it's a genuinely big yeah chunky thing that people can talk about we saw the buzz that people got from elf city and they're always talking about their favorite expansions being the really big thing so we kind of said well why don't we just try to do more of that yeah. so that's what we're going to try next year and the size is going to remain consistent as well it's not going to be smaller in the future it's always going to be big land no, masses well, and we'll see like, what yeah. happens right yeah. so the first half of next year mm -hmm. is as we are at the moment with the, uh, with still Manifest. big chunky updates yeah. uh, but multiples of them in different places in the world um, until June and then it, well until the beginning of June and then June is the first expansion yeah. with Menafos yeah. so and we'll try that out we'll see what happens this is all about talking to the players all about listening to them so we want to see what they think we want to get their feedback from these massive chunks you know we'll see what happens well, we're really excited about Menafos and, and yes. looking forward to seeing yeah, it yeah so yeah Menafos is going to be something else yeah thanks for talking to cheers, us man. cheers thank you